Hey, it's Jimmy. Uh, good afternoon. It's uh, February 9th uh, on a Friday, and uh, the weekend's almost here. Uh, I'm excited to go home. Um, and uh, I've got something I wanted to share with you. Um, I'm, I like to read. I'm a huge newspaper reader, huge newspaper reader, but um, uh, I don't have time for books very often, partly because I tend to listen to my iPod on the train, read the newspaper. Um, but when I was out of town last week, I picked up a book in uh, the airport, and uh, I'm hooked. And I, I wanted to share with you because it's, it's, it's appropriate for uh, what's about to uh, happen in the news. Spring training is here uh, in about a week, and uh, there's nothing better than baseball. Spring training is long, it's arduous, it's uh, something that you just are excited for when it begins, but you can't wait till it's done. And then opening day comes and it all changes. Not only is the weather changing and spring is here, but baseball is back. And uh, I picked up this book. It's called Three Nights in August. And it's by a guy named Buzz Bissinger, who is the same guy who wrote Friday Night Lights, which the movie and TV show of the same name is based on. Um, and I, you know, I'm the kind of guy to talk about books because, frankly, I don't read enough to uh, I don't have the same knowledge of them as I do about movies and TV and all that. I wish I did, but I, I you know, I just don't. Um, but I, I've been I've been reading this book, and it just gets so into the intricacies and the depth of baseball that if you have any kind of interest in baseball, this is just this is the perfect book. Um, what it is is Buzz Bissinger spent many months with Tony La Russa who is the manager of the St. Louis Cardinals, used to be the manager of the White Sox back in the 80s. And instead of writing a, a typical, as told to, uh, autobiography, uh, he and Tony La Russa decided to make it about one three-game series. So the three of them, or the two of them, uh, talked for many months ahead of time. He got to know the team, the players, his coaching staff. And then the book really just kind of breaks down these three games and it happens to in, in August of 2003, and it just so happens that it's against the Cubs. So, and it's during you know a time when the Cubs are playing well, the 2003 season. So it's it's just such an interesting book. It gets into so much of baseball that you don't know. Um, it breaks down bats. It breaks down um, why he does one thing in one moment of one game, and it's just it's as, as you can tell, I'm gushing because uh, uh, it's it's one of these books that I don't want to I don't want to finish because. You know, then I won't I won't be able to read it for the first time again, um, and uh, I'm I'm just so excited about it. So it's three nights in August. Um, it came out a couple years ago, two or three years ago, and uh, maybe maybe more recent than that. But it's not new. It's new to me. And um, if you haven't heard of it, if you haven't seen it, pick it up and and uh, let me know what you think of it. Because man, it's a great great book. Um, all right, enough of me talking about this book. Have a great weekend, and I'll see you back here on Monday. Have a good weekend. Later.